I do is win, 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 no matter what. Got money on my mind, I can't ever get enough. <laughs> I don't know why those lyrics like came out of my I didn't even know I knew <laughs> them. Honestly, you surprised me. I know, I was like, those are all the words I know. And then I was like, I'm just kidding. I know more. I love it. <laughs> Hey guys, so I just realized that I don't have the intro to this video. Um, I originally filmed it with my sister since like, as you'll see the rest of this video is with her, but I just wanted to give you a little intro into what this video is going to be. Um, starting a series called Thrift with V, that is me. And I just take someone who isn't really that much into thrifting or doesn't have that much experience with it and kind of show them how they can make their thrifting dreams possible. and find really affordable, cute outfits that are sustainable and do not break the bank. So we went into this with a budget of $50 um, and we were way under that budget, so super awesome. So stay tuned to get some thrifting tips of your own and uh, maybe get inspired to go out shopping yourself. Okay, so we just went through and picked a bunch of jeans we have them here, so Ami's gonna go try them on and we'll see what we get. Okay, so we have on now the first pair of jeans. Yes, we buy straight leg high rise jeans. Looking like a snack to build for a <laughs> Booty is looking on fire. What is These your view? Are so comfortable. I really like where they end. I feel like this is where you always want my jeans to end and they don't. Tea. They go up, but they're like a mid rise and they're super comfy, which is what I like. I don't do low rise, it's not a thing. But sometimes high waist is a little bit too like restraining. Like I feel like I could like whatever it is. Like you could maybe eat a meal, but also look snatched. Exactly, like these are really comfy. I like that they're faded and distressed a little bit. Like you could tell that someone like really loved these jeans and now I'm gonna love these jeans. Okay, so this second pair, I am so happy. These are like raw denim and a bit of a more like oversized boyfriend jean look. I'm just absolutely in love. I was like, this is a possibility. Also, she's very tall and long-legged and I saw these and I was like, listen. I'm pretty sure these are men's pants, but like. Sure, but look where they fun. land. Like you even have the possibility to raw the hem. You can roll it. Like there's so much possibility here. What is your review? What's the fit feel like? Work, work, fashion baby. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I really, really like these. Um, it's really hard for me to find, like, number one, real denim like this. Number two, like, denim that is, like, comfortable for me, fits my waist, fits my legs, and I can still, like, move around in. It's not restricting in any part. So, I really appreciate that. This is rare for me. I feel like we were just meant to do this today. Yes. Time to the universe. Do your chain hang look, do a well with my flip. Tight in a knot. Yes, we love this boxy chic. <laughs> okay, so these jeans do a little free six phantom. They fit her free. They're well, boot cut, so not they very phantom for the boot cut bottoms, but she was actually looking for shorts that she could cut out from jeans. So these ladies are gonna be the ones that we chop chop because like it just is so kind to your waist and your back. So it's a it's a win. Look out for that DIY flip their their flip, whatever it's called on my channel whenever I figure it out. <laughs> Okay, so we are absolutely in love. Found ourselves the blazer dress of her dreams. Added the little chain belt from my shop just because I was already wearing it to see what it would look like with a belt. And the vision is just, wow, unbelievable. What are your thoughts? I can't believe we found this right away. It was just like staring at us. We started looking through the dresses and we're like, uh, excuse me, hello, thank you so much. And I love her. I think I have like a black slip dress that I could wear under this and like it's a look for me. Tops. So this is definitely not printed, but I could definitely get a lot of use out of this dress, so we picked it up anyway. The only thing is that it has like this stain right here. 
No, it's like an oil stain. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking no. That's the more I look at it, I'm like, you know what? There could be some unflattering angles in this dress. Yeah, you don't need that energy. No, I don't. It's a no. I've changed my mind. She's canceled. Yeah, yes, yes, yes. Hello, welcome back. So it is now the next day and we are going to hit up this second thrift store. Actually third, wow, I love yeah, numbers. Yeah, third, New second day, third store. Second day, third store. Third store. I'm very committed to the cause. Uh, you know, a lot of times with thrifting, it's not a one and done ordeal it's like over months of time but we're like doing this in a limited amount of time so we're hitting up more places basically like two to three days straight yeah like it's fine but honestly I'm living for this this is what I like to spend my time doing honestly if I could thrift every single day I would but I just like can't do that cause like my closet is not that big but this is why this opportunity is amazing for me what's your uh, review this far how has your experience been um, I'm a horrible thrifter on my own. Let's start there. So this has been miraculous for me that I have found because I put together quite a list and I was like, am I gonna get everything that I wanted? And I really didn't think so because that's usually how it goes. But no, I have found what I've wanted in surplus, I think for the most part. So I'm hoping to kind of keep that going for tomorrow. I did find a printed dress and I like it, but I'm open to find like to finding another one. Um, and I'm just like really excited. I never usually feel this way about thrifting because I have such bad luck with it. It's not that I'm not interested. I've tried. I just suck. Um, there's that. But this has been such a fun experience. And we've really been balling on a budget. I feel like I've just like redone my whole closet with like less than $50. So. And we have hit that student discount two days in a row. Like on how accident. blessed. Also, this woman is just about to be literally directly in front of us watching us film. This old woman is just judging the fuck out of us. But you know what? Do she pay our bills? No. There you go. There you go, folks. What we have left to look for is silk tops and like still looking for belts, just seeing like we got two, a black one or a brown one. But if we find something, that'd be cool. And we are looking for printed dresses. So let's see what we find. Kind of vibe. Yeah. I like it. That's really what I'm looking for. Something light and easy to layer, but really cute. I like the button details and that the print is floral for spring, but not tacky, which is like really hard to master. And that's a good dress to transition into fall. Yes, especially in Florida. Mm -hmm. You know how it is. And this um, is a beautiful. <laughs> Let's cancel whoever made this. Jill, we are trying on the silk tops. We weren't that much in luck with a lot of the sizes, but this one seems to fit her very well. It's nice, versatile, depending on she can wear like a white t-shirt underneath. She could wear it just like out with a skirt, tuck some jeans, just to make it cute and casual or dress it up. It's just a great basic to have in your closet. I feel like the silhouette is like yours, but just a little bit like looser, so it leaves illusion of like what can be here without being like a sack. Like you don't look like a sack, it definitely like cinches. And I think, yeah, with a belt, that would really like cinch that waist a little bit more if that's something you were looking for some days. Mm -hmm. But I feel like it definitely gives like sundress vibes. Let's show you the mirror. Wow, it's like very dirty just right here. Like who did that? I like how it's like a little bit longer on the side. Yeah, I'm a fan. What's your final verdict? I'm getting there. Yeah. And if we go to another thrift store, I will continue to look as well. So we are back from looking through this thrift store. It was not actually the one that I intended to go to. I like <laughs> literally have no sense of direction and I thought I was going to one that I knew had like a big section of silk tops, but we didn't. But we still discovered that there were some there. A lot of cute ones, they were just way too big. Um, but she did end way up finding one, so that's pretty awesome. Um, and then we also got the printed dress, so pretty excited. We are actually gonna hit another one up tomorrow, the one that I actually intended to go to because, you know, 
it just be like that. So you're just gonna like see us in a bunch of outfits basically, but it's because we're staying authentic and letting you know the time it's taking us to find these things. But honestly, even thus far, like I feel like we've been very successful. Uh, so just really being a perfectionist on this, I wanna make sure that we can find her everything before I go back to Boston. <laughs> so we will be seeing you tomorrow and hopefully the final installation in which we will find everything that we want. I'm so scary in these no makeup clips. I look like a little gremlin in the corner. Like, <laughs> Hello. Hello. I would like your gold, please. What's the riddle, bitch? <laughs> My hair is like very playing me. We're pretending that it's not like humid and raining and basically feels like we're walking through an ocean every time we're outside. Don't make it glamorous, a swamp. A swamp, <laughs> <Right. laughs> So we are at the final Goodwill location and very hype, hoping to find the last few things. Uh, the remaining items on the list are silk tops, still on the market for some silk tanks. Or like lacy lingerie, tanks. lacy, something, you know, sis. We're looking for some printed dresses, you know, mm -hmm. you can never have enough of those, especially mm -hmm. because there's so many different styles of dresses, yeah. like just something that's different from what we found already at the first, second, the one third. of third location. Yeah. We're really doing the most. We are, so fourth and final, and we will see what we come out with, and I'll see you on the other side. Bye. So this is the first top we're trying on in this new location. I'm a very big fan. It fits very well. And the color is really cute and also unique. It's like new true. We love it. And it also has like this little like built-in bra thing. Yeah. Like it's pretty nice. Like support. No nip slips today. Okay, I'm wearing a bra that I can do. Oh no, what's your review? I like it. I feel like it would go really well with like jeans. I can just like get a lot of use out of it because it's such a neutral color, but it's not black because I tend to get a lot of But no shame in the game. Just take a moment to see these ugly walls. Like, who let her? Do you want me to hate myself and everything that I stand for? Because it's done. It's <laughs> secure. So I feel like it had potential. Like, but this little thing here, like, I'm not sure what they were trying to do there, but the answer is no. Let's not give a flaw I do like that this one is a little bit, like, looser. Yeah. And I wanted her to fit perfectly, but, like, this situation is just not a vibe. Like, sometimes, like, so cute on hanger, but on, on person? No. <laughs> so, this has a very cute shape, cute top, but then it goes down very low to mind her jeans on the floor. <laughs> Like a little bit more form-fitting and it was that like long. Yeah. If it was like this, it would be fine, you know? Oh, me? Yeah, you can see the full length. Grab on. Me. Grab on. I'd rather jump. have it like as a top and tuck it in because the top fits really nicely. So maybe I get it anyways and have my grandma make it into a top. She definitely could. So we'll see. Depending on how much it is, I might just do that and just have her like Maybe cut it like here because this it, like would, cinches in right here. Like, yeah, and it would tuck into a pair of pants really nicely or like a skirt. And I like the detail like, here a lot. Yes, girl. This is a vibe. It's cute, fits you right. I'm a fan. She's just holding it because laziness. I really don't feel like tying. But I like the fit and I like that it's black and white so you can go with a lot of things. Mm -hmm. But it's still like a fun pattern. Yeah. And without the bralette, it would look a lot spicier. But y'all don't have to see that. That's for her. So comfortable. The material feels really good too because I wasn't looking for like a t-shirt material type of dress. So we like it. We love it. We want some more of it. Printed dress. Check. For under $40, we were able to get three pairs of jeans, two belts, three silk tanks, one blazer dress, and two pattern dresses. <laughs> Literally a mood. <laughs> Hello, chickadees. 
So we're back, the final clip. Yes, you made it to the end of this journey. It's been a trip. That it has. We had visited in total four thrift stores? In three? No. Four thrift stores, three days. We were yeah. committed to the cause and really did not want to give up on anything on this list. And ultimately, the only thing we could not find was the silk tops. But honestly, we ended up being like, you know, it must be a sign from the universe because it's just like not the weather for that. Yeah, coming it's hot up. and humid right now. It's, it's been raining all day, up. as you can see. Had hair in my mouth. Ew. <laughs> it was my own hair, thankfully, but you know, still, she was there. Thank goodness. I know, it'd be a little <laughs> concerning if it wasn't. How'd she get there? But it's, yeah, it's been kind of hideous out, and like, we're just getting closer to the hot summer months, so like, Wearing a short, like wearing a silk tank is one thing, but like wearing long sleeve silk when it's hot, like no material gives you away quicker than silk does when you just She's have like- gonna wrap you out. Just like a drop of sweat. She's like, Hello. here, Hello. hi, <laughs> in case you're wondering, present, here. So it was just pretty successful. I'm really happy how this turned out. This is the first of these types of videos that I have. Uh, attempted so if you guys like seeing this kind of content and would like to see me take more of my friends family strangers out thrifting you know <laughs> like you know we'll see we'll see Stranger what happens danger. I mean T but unless you want to become my friend that's cool too that's what they all say that's true kind of scary it was yeah. a fun experience overall we got a lot of stuff for fifty dollars somewhere on the screen we're gonna put the grand total like exactly but that was the budget we stuck to it we got even more yeah i mean we didn't get one thing on the list but we got multiples of others you know so it all balances out. If you like this video, please make sure to like it down below. It really helps me out. And comment any suggestions for anything you would like to see from me. And if you have not already, please subscribe to join the squad. And I don't know why I make little tiny fists all the time. It's like I'm just like getting ready to fight or like, I don't even know. Oh yeah, like there's like a cheers and like this is just like my automatic like defense mechanism. I don't, I don't know. We don't know. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching this video, and I hope to see you in my next one. Bye. Bye.